praise the lord i'm very happy to meet you happy to talk to you let us pray before we could share the word heavenly father we praise you we thank you bless this time of fellowship bless the time of sharing the word the word is life giving the word changes the life thank you for the word we give you glory and honor in jesus name i pray amen we know that we are in a situation where uh, we are in lockdown we are not able to move around like uh, how we used to already i uh, released a message in the topic of crisis hope you remember how in john chapter 20 the disciples were locked inside a door uh, they were frightened if we go out it's not going to be favor to us if we go outside people might destroy us so such a fear about the roman soldiers fear about the circumstances the disciples was inside the locked door but jesus walked inside that door i told the peace be still and they were all frightened they were not able to believe he blew on them and said go and wait for the promised holy spirit today i wanted to talk about waiting in the presence of god the difficult part in the christian walk is waiting in the presence of god we can do so many things for god but waiting in god is very difficult this time i wanted to share that waiting is more important waiting in his presence is very very important jesus said in acts chapter 1 after resurrection meeting them in john 20 and acts 1 he says wait for the promise holy spirit to come upon you isaiah 40 we read though that wait upon the lord will renew their strength david says in psalm 62:1 truly my soul waits your soul should rest how long does it takes to come to a clear surrender or you know how long will it take the soul to rest because we are you know easily we are caught up with so many problems around us so many negative things around us so many noises pollutions but today in this lockdown you have come to a situation there's no much of noise pollution and everything is calm it's a beautiful time that you get up early in the morning and seek the face of the lord just waiting not just speaking but just waiting staying still psalms 135 says i will wait for the lord i will wait for my lord david says in psalm 135 130 was 5 i will wait for my lord i will wait for my master to come who can quicken you is the holy spirit Jesus will walk in that door. Jesus will walk in that house and he will fasten you to catch up with him. When you catch up with him, everything around you though it looks dark, but you will feel the light of Christ. You will feel the hope. You will have the faith revive. You will know that the future is set bright for you. Psalms 25 verse 5 says, "I wait all day long." Abraham waited all day long. for god to come and bless him he waited in the heat of the day the bible says waiting is very important how long should i wait wait until he quickens you you will know in your soul in your spirit that you are revived you are once again activated to the way you are before when you heard about christ when you were saved when you had received the salvation you had a great joy but the joy is reduced now what is he trying to say even the darkness may cover if it comes because i walk with the christ who is light jesus is light of this world and he said so you also the light of the world waiting and resting in the lord both are very important waiting and resting we need to wait we need to be calm we need to allow the holy spirit to talk with it when he quickens you all your fiber all your cells will know that he is in you he is coming over you he is doing something in you you will deep down in your heart you will know 
that he is quickening you once again he is talking to you once again that life comes when you wait in the presence of god today isaiah 3018 said blessed that all day wait upon the lord when you wait god comes to quicken quicken you Psalm 42:7 to 8 says God quickens us to reach him This is the place to meet and know him When you're quickened you catch up with God Your mindset changes your thought process changes your belief system changes now you know that you know that you know that God is with you and he's going to do something great Let us pray Waiting is very important Father even in this lockdown situation we want to wait in your presence because he that wait upon the lord though that wait upon the lord will renew their strength waiting renews my strength it quickens me it strengthens me it activates my spiritual life it quickens the spirit man to catch up with you to catch up with the plan that you have for me give you glory and honor help us to wait and rest in your presence all day long Amen and amen. Surrender to God and wait. He will quicken you. God bless you.